M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Learning video on the ARDV1 RRUK, which is Radio Reference UK. Now, you do need to subscribe to this to download the frequencies and use them. I'm just teaching you how to do this. So, the software that is used for the ARDV1 and DV10 is this one here, and it actually runs using a browser. It's not a download, it's a browser. So, this is, I'll put the link in the description for the browser, and you will end up with this this program here, and that's, this is blank now. So let's go over to RRUK, we'll log in, and we'll go to search, and we'll just keep it nice and simple now. We'll go to amateur, we'll select two meters, and then here we've got scanner export, okay? We'll go scanner export, and as you go down, we can choose AOR DV10 or AOR DV1, so we'll choose DV10, okay? And now it's automatically selecting something because I've been already been using this on my PC. But what you would normally do is have the SD card plugged into your PC and it will read from that. This is reading from a file in my computer and it knows already that I've got add more frequencies to bank 33 or add frequencies and start a new bank. And above that it says bank used 34, banks remaining 6. And it knows that. I don't know how, but it does. So what we can do is, let's just say we want to add frequencies and start a new bank. We'll click that. Then we'll just choose a random frequencies for now. We'll just go airports. We'll choose Bristol because that's near me. Where's Bristol? Bristol here. And then we'll go scanner, export, AOR DV10. And hopefully it's put those frequencies into that bank. And then we'll just go finish and download memory file, which comes up as a CSV file here with DV10 written. So now we'll just go open. We'll double click that file. It does tell us the file info if we press the little plus and minus here. Okay, there's file info. We'll scroll down and we're gonna start looking inside these Bank. So look, memory bank here. Let's go to number 33. Number 33 at the top. And look, there's a load of frequencies there. Now I'm not seeing all these airband frequencies, like it said, but look, you can see there. And let's go to number 35. Let's go to saying here, banks use 35. Let's try 35. Nothing there at all. Let's go to bank number. 10. There's a load of frequencies there from a previous thing. So bit by bit I'm learning this. It's giving me the option to add more frequencies to bank 34, add frequencies to start a new bank. So we'll go add more frequencies to bank 34, click amateur, this time we'll do 70, we'll do scanner export, AOR DV, and then we'll go finish and download, and we this one here, M0F, so we DV 10 3, so we'll go open. We'll choose that, DV10-3. There's all the 70 sems, and where's it put it? It's put it in bank zero. So I'm not really sure what it's paying out. It could be the fact that I haven't got an SD card plugged into my PC, but it's loading lots of frequencies, isn't it? And they're all 70 sems. So this is as far as I got, and I know we can save as we go. Look, click save here, save. There's the file saved. So when I've got the device, I'll be able to, you know, do some more learning. But I think it still gives you a basic idea of how you can use RRUK to do this. Now, there is the radio reference in America. I'll quickly look at that. So we we'll go radioreference.com. I'm in the UK. Here it is here. Now, I have got an account with radio reference. Oh, it's remembered me already. Database, home. Oh, wow. So radio reference. So I think that will be for another video. I'm logged in and we're going to have a go at doing some scanner exporting to the DV1, DV10 uh, in a future video. But for now, just give you, getting you a feel for it. Thanks for watching my channel. Bye for now.